Hello and welcome to a very special episode of GMG News. So yesterday was my birthday, so my younger sister, knowing how much I like Harry Potter, decided to get me two of the Harry Potter original Funko Pop figures. These are vinyl figures. Um, these are two I've been after for a long time. So uh, starting from right to left, right we have number six, um, Lord Voldemort, Tom Riddle, the badass himself. With the Elder Wand in his hands, so I'm taking, this is from the Deadly Hallows uh, book, or the, either one of the films where he gains um, Voldemort's, Voldemort, sorry, where he gains Dumbledore's wand, um, the Elder Wand, which is like the most powerful wand, and then obviously at the end of the movie, he snaps it in half, well, Harry does anyway, um, and on the left, just here, we have... Harry Potter himself, but we have edition 31, he's holding Hegwig in his hand, um, wearing the Gryffindor robes, scarf, and them signature glasses of his. Um, so we're just going to turn these round just to show you the different versions that you can get. So we're just going to start with this one. So for this version of Harry Potter, the others that go with this version, we have Harry Potter number 32 holding the... Let me see if I can go bit of a better view on it. Okay, no we can't. But he is essentially holding um, the prophecy from the Order of Phoenix. 33, we have Fred Weasley with his little suitcase. 34, we have George Weasley holding some presents. 35, we have Bellatrix Lestrange. I want to get Bellatrix Lestrange. I like her as an actress as well. The actress who plays her, she's awesome. Uh, 30. Six, we have Lucius Malfoy, the coward himself. Thirty-seven, we have Maneva McGonagall, um, who is obviously like the head of Gryffindor. Thirty-eight, we have Mad Eye Moody. I always like Mad Eye Moody. And thirty-nine, we have Dorel's Umbridge. Um, I've never actually seen her as a figure anywhere. If anyone has, please let me know. So yeah, they're the ones that you can get with this version of Harry Potter. Now with this version of Lord Voldemort, or Tom Riddle as we call him. Uh, number one. We have Harry Potter himself in the Gryffindor robes. Number two, we have Ron Re Ronald Weasley or Ron Weasley in his uh, Gryffindor robes with the broken wand. Uh, number three, we have Hermione Granger in her Gryffindor robes with her wand. Number four, we have Albus Dumbledore. Um, number five, we have Severus Snape. Number six is Lord Voldemort, the one I'm holding in my hands right now and number seven is a six inch figure of albus sorry Rub um, rubius hagrid um but obviously like he's a giant in the film so obviously he's going to be a bigger figure so yeah we're just going to very quickly unbox these and see what they look like outside the boxes so we're just going to start from left to right now so first of all we're going to take harry out um, you need to be over three years to collect these figures as they do contain some small parts which could potentially be a choking hazard also if you like Funko go to www.funko.com for um, for the latest and greatest information about them they have um, a little feature on their site at the moment where you can create your own pop figures like just digitally at the moment uh, you can add all different faces and stuff onto them really cool um, they've done the scar very well on this let me see if we can just let's see if we can see that yeah Really nice looking figure, really nice feel to it as well. Um, on the bottom, it's even printed saying Funko. It's got a little advert saying www.funko.com. Uh, really nice feel to the glasses as well. They don't feel flimsy or like they're going to fall off. And you can see like, where they're attached. It's not just like part of his face, so that's really cool. So it's kind of like a, another bit that they've added onto it. Uh, it's quite a bit of detail on Hedwig. And uh, oh, yeah, she's even got her own little eyes. Which is really cool. Um, so yeah, that's really cool. I'm just gonna put him just to one side like that, and he balances quite well. Um, doesn't need a stand or anything. There is no stand, as you can see in the box. Um, so yeah, he stands quite well out of his box. It's quite funny to actually see him out of the box because if you look at the dimension of that, that whole box for that little thing. <laughs> but we all love Funko. But anyway, like I was saying. Um, and also, if you like Funko, go to Twitter, at Original Funko, Instagram, at Original Funko, and Facebook, www.facebook.com forward slash Original Funko, to find out all about their latest and greatest products and the things that are coming out with them. So last but not least, we're going to open up He Who Should Not Be Named, 
well, I'm going to name him now anyway, Lord Morton, or, or Tom Riddle, <clears throat> or Mr. No Face, or Mr. No Nose. Because, let's be fair, it, it must. How does he sneeze? I've always wondered that. If anyone knows, let me know. But yeah, really nice looking figure, really nice feel to it. Come, uh, movable head. I didn't actually check that with Harry if I could move his head or so. Uh, yes, you can. Stands up on his own, uh, with his hands. Like to the one side like this. If I can just move his head around, we'll see if we can see the wand a bit better. So yeah, that's the um I think that's it the elder one. But yeah. Really cool looking figure. If we stand them up together, I wonder if either is bigger than the other. So Okay, I'll put this one a little bit forward. Right, that they both stood next to each other. They're both the exact same size. Um I think Voldemort's head is slightly bigger, but it's really nice detail on both of them, and I'm really happy that I got both of these figures, so I just want to say a big thank you to my sister for buying these for me, um, and thank you to everyone who's been watching GMG News, because we've just reached over 82,000 channel views, which I'm really happy with, um, so thanks for watching my channel guys, um, stay tuned for the next video where I'll be unboxing Doctor Strange, thank you for watching GMG News, and have a good day guys.